Texas. Just call them the Lopes, folks. The Lopes are the 12th seed in the West. 29 wins, most of school history. Only 12 sports was there for GCU's Selection Sunday watch party in Las Vegas. They open against the fifth seed, St. Mary's Friday in Spokane. Tip off, 705, 12 sports will be there. St. Mary's won 18 of their last 19 to get in. Time for that normal 5-12 upset, maybe. Hmm. 12 sports journalist Luke Lid, the only local TV reporter on the ground in Vegas when the Lopes got the news. It's a moment you dream of as a little kid, punching your ticket to the big dance. Now, GCU head coach Bryce Drew has talked about how difficult it is to win a championship, but it's moments like these that don't come around too often that make it all worth it. Let the confetti fall because the Lopes have punched their ticket. Cut down the nets and are going dancing. And less than 24 hours later, the Lopes and fans found themselves in a crowded conference room waiting for their name to be called. Yet they had to wait and wait some more. Coach Bryce Drew and others holding their breath until the last region was finally revealed. GCU, man. It's old. Uh, so exciting, so exciting, um, you know, to, to have the feeling that you know you're going to the NCAA tournament, and then just the anticipation of, of waiting to see where you're going to go, who you're going to play. And we got to wait, you know, for, for all the brackets. So being in the last bracket just added the suspense. And we're just real anxious. We wanted to see where we, where we were going to be at, who we were going to play, so we can really just uh, get a feel for it, uh, like right now, and, and get, get to the scout report. Okay. It's unbelievable. Even just, you know, my last year, my senior year, you know, ended it out like this. And, you know, it's just, it's not even the end. It's, it's we're still continuing, but excited for what's in store. It's a roller coaster ride to get to the finish line, and the Lopes are embracing this moment before the real work begins. In all the cheering, a lot of that was also confidence, too. You know, confidence in our guys that, uh, you know, we put in the work. And, um, you know, I think God's writing a great story. So there you have it. 12 seed GCU will face five seed St. Mary's out in Spokane, Washington for the first round of the NCAA tournament. And like the Lopes have been telling me, the job isn't done yet. Oof, can't wait for the madness to begin. But for now, reporting one final time in Las Vegas, Luke Litton, 12 Sports.